What's up guys, it's me Lego Paradise here and today I'm going to show you how to build this working Lego treadmill. As you can see, this functioning treadmill is fully motorized so you can run it at different speeds so you can start out slow and slowly increase the speed to go from jogging to running and finally at the top speed where your minifigures will be sprinting along and getting a really good workout. This is a super cool effect, it really looks like the minifigures are actually running along the treadmill and it's a fantastic addition to your LEGO gyms. So while this minifigure is getting some exercise, let's take a look at how to build it. Here are all of the bricks you're going to need to build your working LEGO treadmill. You'll also need 15 of these tank tread pieces for the actual treadmill belt itself. So once you've collected your pieces, we'll start by building the sides. And these are not quite identical. So first take two of your 1x2 and 1x3 plates and attach 1x1 brick on this side and a another 1x3 plate over on the top in the middle. Then a 1x1 plate with this attachment on the end. Then on this side use a 1x1 round tile. That's important for the spacing and a one by one Technic brick with the hole facing this way over on top of that piece. Then a one by two Technic axle brick next to that and a regular one by one brick over in this gap here. So that should look just like this. Then you can continue the top with a one by two curved slope piece and a one by one tile over in the top just like that. Then a 1x3 click hinge plate over on the other side. And we can put this assembly aside for now because next we're going to build the other side. And that is a similar design. So two of these 1x2 and 1x3 plates next to each other. Secure them in place with a 1x3 plate. Then a regular 1x1 plate on this side. But this time a difference which is a one by one Technic brick on this side, a one by two Technic axle brick on the other side. And before we clip this brick in, we're gonna to wanna to place our second one by one plate with this attachment. And then that Technic brick just goes over the top there. You also need to attach a one by one round tile on this side. So that way both of these tiles should be facing inward. And you'll notice they actually create a little bit of an overhang over in the middle, which is exactly what we want. And then we can just build up the top the same way as we did with the first side. Now with both sides built, it's time to fill in the gears, which will hold the actual treadmill belt in place. So use a 1x4 axle over here and slide a gear in there with a Technic bushing in the middle for a bit of spacing and a second gear over on that side. Then on this one, we will slide a long 1x8 axle. This is where we'll drive the treadmill through. Same gear configuration. So just one of these 2x2 two two gears, a 1x1 one one Technic bush piece and another 2x2 two two gear. And you can start to see how these will connect together. So one more thing we need to do before we connect these sections together is to slide a 1x5 axle through there and that will basically join these two sections together because you can see there's not quite enough space to join them together with a regular plate or a brick but an axle fits just perfectly and still allows both of these gears to move around which is perfect for this treadmill. Now let's build the handle that will allow the minifigures to hang on to the treadmill. So this just uses these pieces right here and attach a similar piece with the Technic hole over at the top. And we can build this up on both sides since it's pretty much identical. Only difference is these one by one pin pieces, they just go in the middle of these Technic holder pieces. And then the 1x4 bar can be slid through the middle. You might need to do some adjustment later on. 
but that should be the basic shape of this whole section and then just clip that on to these two little clip areas so that should clip on nicely just like that and this will allow you to angle these bars down and just make sure that's nice and adjusted on both sides and that will give your minifigures somewhere to hold so finally for the last part of this lego treadmill is to attach the conveyor so this is actually attached over the top of these gears so you don't actually attach anything in the middle you just have to clip this whole conveyor belt section in place once everything is attached in place and make sure everything's all clipped down and there you go your working lego treadmill is complete and we can test this out by placing a minifigure over onto the treadmill and you'll see as the treadmill rolls back the minifigure will jump around slightly this effect will be much more noticeable if we connect this treadmill to a motor so let's do that here's how you can connect it with a power functions motor so for this setup you'll need a motor that's connected to an infrared receiver and that will be connected to a battery box you also need a power functions remote control to allow you to change the speed and go from slow to fast on your treadmill so to connect everything together if you want to have the treadmill next to a wall you can just slide a Technic brick through the axle and then connect that to the motor and this way your treadmill will sit nice and flush against any wall of any of the buildings or Lego gyms that you want to have this treadmill built into and then we can finish off the wall by building it up some more and now your treadmill should be ready to work so let's switch on the battery box and you'll see as I increase the speed the treadmill will go faster and faster you want to make sure it's going the right way so there you go we start out slowly and by turning the controller some more the motor will speed up and the treadmill will go even faster and faster and that's a really cool effect and as you can see you can easily hide away all of the motor and the battery box components over at the back if you don't want to be able to see them in your construction so if you enjoyed building your working lego treadmill be sure to give this video a like let me know in the comments what you think of this design and subscribe to my channel be sure to enable all notifications so you always know when my latest videos are available also check out my other how to build a working lego videos where i build lots of different functional minifigure scale machines and creations just like this one so i'll see you guys next time and thanks for watching